What up, y'all? Dread is back for the second time today. Now, this topic is um, what I think of FWB or friends with benefits. <laughs> All right, for people who ain't up to speed on uh, what that means, is uh, friends with benefits is um, two people of the opposite sex or the same sex if you're gay. I don't leave the gays out, but it's two people who are friends who engage in sexual intercourse from time to time aka fuck buddies you know that's the uh, technical terms for it but that, well that's the um the rated r version of it but as far as what i think of friends with benefits i think well just because of my morals and the way that i look at it and how relationships are supposed to be i think the friends with benefits is a bad idea and i think it's a bad idea for three reasons the first reason why i think it's a bad idea is because well let's just say you, or, you know because somebody is going to catch feelings somewhere down the line all right you know y'all keep seeing each other you know whether it's you know days weeks months and then when you get close to that year mark and then like not only is it not not only do you just not see you see him for sex but you know you start to get to know a little bit more about him or actually if you take the time to get to know more about him and then one of y'all is gonna be like hey you break you breaking the friends of benefits rule hey this is just supposed to be kind of a smash and just go on kind of things i don't want to get to know i don't want to get to know what's in your soul i don't want to get to know what's in your heart i don't want to know what you're thinking is this is supposed to be just for fun and then one of them is going to get end up getting pissed off and then you know they're gonna go on to the next one i guess you know that's you know one reason why you know friends benefit is a bad idea in my eyes because you know hey somebody is you know somebody's gonna catch feelings you know whether it be the man or the woman one of y'all it's gonna happen to one of y'all number two i think this is one of the most um i think this is man eh, number three that was coming up too but number two friends of benefits also means that you thinking you know hey you know the dude's thinking, hey, you know, this this girl's my friends with benefits, or this uh, chick thinking, hey, you know, this guy's my friend with benefits. Uh -uh. Nope, ladies, his dick is not only exclusive to you, fellas. Her pussy is not only exclusive to you. That's the word, the term friends with benefits, and that's why it's a double edged sword because friends with benefits is not what you think it is. Guess what? I mean, you she could, I mean, he she could have multiple friends with benefits up on the side. You really think that you you're the only one who's knocking out of the park like Mike Piazza, Mark McGuire, and Sammy Sosa? Nope, fellas. I mean, if really, and uh, ladies, do you think that you uh, you think that you uh, own his penis? Do you really think just because you have sex with him that you know, and you're his friend of benefits, you think that he don't have other friends or other side chicks on you know who he's friends of benefits with? Uh uh, that's another thing. You are not only, it's just because you're a friend of benefits, it does not mean that you are exclusive only to that person. All right, number three. I said number two is the worst, but, you know, number two and number three are neck and neck in my eyes. All right, but number three is, like, um, your benefits can be thrown out the window anytime. You can cut them off anytime you want to. They can cut you off anytime they want to. All right, and here's a good example. Let's just say that you and this, you know, and your friend with benefits, you know, y'all friends, you know, y'all have been doing it for a while, like three, four, five, six months or whatever. And then they run into somebody who they think could be Mr. or Mrs. Wright. And, you know, they like, OK, well, we got to stop this friend of benefits thing because I'm in a relationship now. Guess what? Your, your friends with benefits, your benefits is out the window. So, yeah, it's all gone right there. But anyway, that's why I think that friends of benefits is a bad idea. Now, have, have y'all done that? You know, do y'all, how are y'all, how do y'all feel about friends of benefits? Oh, yeah, and another reason why is because of the STD to spread. That's a bonus. But anyway, what do y'all think of friends of benefits? I'm out, y'all. Peace.